Hello and welcome to my channel. Please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thank you all so much for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you to my day ones, twos, and threes. Thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in. That means well. Thank you so very much. I appreciate you all. And welcome, welcome, welcome. This video is for entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is alleged, some is not. And the fair act use is in my description box y'all so let's get to it y'all let's get to it um y'all what is going on right now we just lost another legend another one frankie beverly has passed away at age 77 the announcement was made at approximately 8 a.m on september the 11th According to the Post, Beverly, whose real name is Howard Stanley Beverly, passed away yesterday. Okay, y'all? Um, the family has not released any details about why he passed and are asking for privacy and understanding during their period of healing. Y'all, Frankie Beverly is gone? This guy had the most feel-good, happy family time music ever, y'all. I can't believe it. Like, what is going on? Beverly was an American singer, songwriter, and producer, best known as the founder and frontman of the R&B band Maze. Born on December the 6th, 1946 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Beverly's musical career began in the 1960s with his doo-wop group, The Blenders. Later, he formed a soul group called The Butlers, which saw some regional success. But in the early 1970s, Beverly relocated to San Francisco Bay Area and formed Maze. Oh my goodness. The band's big break came when Marvin Gaye, a fan of Beverly's sound, invited them to tour as his opening act in 1977. Mays released their debut album, Mays featuring Frankie Beverly, which included the hits Happy Feelings, y'all. And While I'm Alone, Known for their smooth blend of soul, funk, and R&B, Mays became a staple in the 70s and 80s music scene, producing classical songs like Joy and Pain, Before I Let Go, Oh My Goodness, and Golden Time of Day. Oh my goodness, my goodness, my, what is going on, y'all? My goodness. Rest in peace to legendary Beverly, Frankie Beverly, y'all. Rest in peace. Condolences to his family. I almost said Beverly Mays, y'all, because I, I got Mays on my mind, okay? But um, rest in peace to another legendary king that has been taken too soon, y'all. Um, What's going on, y'all? We have legendary people that we're losing right now. Tributes are pouring in for the singer because he touched so many lives, y'all. So many. May this man rest in peace. His family posted up, given the loss of a loved one is a deeply personal and emotional experience during this time. As we are navigating feelings of sorrow, reflecting, reflection and remembers, we kindly ask for privacy and understanding allow us the space to grieve in our own way this period for um is one of healing and your respect for our need to solitude is appreciated as we honor the memory of our beloved howard stanley beverly known to the world as frankie beverly he lived his life with pure soul as one would say and for us no one did it better. He lived for his music, family, and friends. Love one another as he would want that for all of us. Howard Stanley Beverly, a.k.a. Frankie Beverly.
this is what you know the family is posting up y'all what is going on we are losing legends after legends after legends after legends y'all we just lost the lion king y'all and then now frankie beverly what is going on condolences to the family the friends um the fans Shout out to Philadelphia for sharing him with us as well, y'all. Um, I know that, that you know, they got to be hurting. This is one of their legends. This one of all of our legends. We shared them with y'all, okay? Rest in peace. Rest in peace. So many artists is sending out condolences right now. A lot of people are posting up about Beverly and how he touched so many lives and with his music and everything. Um, Atlanta Mayor Andre Dickens released a statement in response to his passing as well. Beverly performed several times in the metro area, Atlanta area. I joined the rest of the world in mourning the passing of the legendary musician, singer, songwriter, and producer Be Frankie Beverly. Earlier this year, I had the honor of presenting him with the Phoenix Award. I didn't even know that. Wow. The city of Atlanta's highest honor in recognition of his timeless musical contributions and extraordinary impact on the entertainment industry. Frankie sold out concerts at Chestain Amphitheater. I hope I said that right. Um, created memories for countless Atlantans and visitors from across the region. His music was truly the soundtrack of many of our lives and my thoughts are with his family, all who loved him and all who were impacted by his gift. He was so very gifted, y'all. He really, really was. Um, Wow. He got the mayors and everybody coming forth on him. Everybody is sending their condolences in. So many big artists is coming out, sending that they're just pouring in right now. A lot of people, okay. Um, a lot of people starting to report on social media. I was kind of busy this morning. I heard about it, but I had to. I was running late, so I had to get up out of here and um, do what I had to do and come on back. But I had to definitely jump on here and send my condolences out and say rest in peace to this king right here, y'all. Okay, so um. Man, thank you for everything that you have done for us, okay? And all the music that you brought to us and the happiness and the joy, okay? Anyway, please like, share, and subscribe if you like the video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.